Hey y'all, I'm Abby, More Than Just Skin. Welcome back to my channel. Okay, so what I'm talking about today is a run, do not walk situation. I may have found the perfect cooler toned eyeshadow palette. Well, I should say eyeshadow quad and it's $3. And right now while I'm filming this, the website has 30% off all eye products. I think that would make it $2. I'm a lawyer, not a mathematician, but yeah, I think that would be like close to $2. And the palette that I am talking about is the Silent Treatment Quad by Wet n Wild. Y'all, this little quad is so good if you are looking for cool tones. Um, I just really cannot say enough good things about it. It has a shimmery kind of beigey tone that I actually use because it's not too shimmery. It's more of what I consider a satin and you can't see it on my hand, but oh, sorry about that. You actually can't see it on my hand, but I use that on the entire lid. Then you have this transition shade right here, which to me is a perfect transition shade. It's kind of a dusty, rosy color, and I don't think that these swatch great, but I'm not worried about the swatches because I'm gonna apply them to my eyes and show y'all what I have been doing with this palette, and I really, really have been loving it. So what we are gonna do now, if you're interested in seeing and judging for yourself if this is the perfect little cool tone quad, hit that subscribe button, and here we go. Okay, so I have all of my makeup on right now, and y'all, today what I did, this is kind of crazy, I just went through like some samples of makeup and put stuff on. Um, yeah, so the color may not be just right, actually, I think it's a little yellowy, I don't know, it just doesn't really look, it actually looks better through the camera than it does in person, which is good for y'all, but um, after this I will be taking it all because I just don't think it's that great. But, and highlight is a little crazy, at least on this side. This side, I kind of went in. They don't seem to match, is what I'm trying to say. But, that's not the focus of this video. The focus of this video is this little quad. So, I have already primed my eyelids. And what I'm going to do first is I'm going to go in with this, this beige shade on a fluffy brush. I'm just going to load my brush up. There is a little bit of fallout. I'm going to tap that off. And I'm going to just kind of set my eye with that. Also on a fluffy brush, I'm now going to go in with this dusty rose color. This is going to be like the transition shade. Okay, for this look today, I'm going to go in with this deeper color, this kind of grayish color, and it does have a little bit of a sheen to it. And I am just going to kind of pop that in the outer V. And a little bit heavier right there in the crease. To me, this color would be a good kind of one-stop shop where you could actually take it on your finger, put it all over your lid, and blend it out into your crease. If you've been watching me for a while, you kind of know that's what I like to do for everyday looks, everyday going to work, uh, just easy. So, yeah, that is definitely something that can be done with this shade. Taking that same brush, I'm going in with this darker shade just on the tip, and I'm going to deepen up that outer V. Now I'm going to take a brush and blend that out. I'm going to go in with a smaller brush back into that light shade and I'm just going to place that kind of right here on the inner corner as well just to kind of brighten up the inner part of the eye. Now one of the things I like about this is I love that you can use this as an eyeliner and um, I was wearing this as an eyeliner and I actually got compliments on it. They're like, what is on your, what's your eyeliner? And I was like, it's shadow. I did not tell them it was wet and wild shadow. I should have, but I didn't. But yeah, it is great. So I take a, a eyeliner brush and I'm just going to line my eye. There 
is some fallout if you can see down there but I'm just gonna take a brush and kind of I'm going to also line my lower lash line with that as well but I think you can see how pigmented that is a pencil brush I'm going to go in with this shade that yes is some shimmer and I'm going to smudge that out Okay, now to curl and that's all I'm doing with the eye look and I did it all with this little three dollar could be two dollar quad now I'm going to curl my lashes Okay, I already have some lipstick on, but I'm just going to put on a little gloss. This is Buxom Claire. So, yeah, this is the finished look. What do y'all think? I think it's great for work. I have been loving it. It is so easy. Such a great little quad. I will say not all these quads are created equal. I purchased the Walking on Eggshells one and it left a lot to be desired so this one i really really like not sure i'll be trying any more but yeah if you have tried some of the other little quads from wet and wild let me know in the comments below what your thoughts are on it if you enjoyed this video please consider giving me a thumbs up please consider subscribing i would love to have you back here on a regular basis and as always i hope this video finds you having a fantastic day and a great week and i will see you all soon bye y'all